Ooh, this might look good out here. I'm currently in Statesboro, Georgia at my apartment. I go to Georgia Southern University. I haven't really done any vlogs like this, like college vlogs, and I am a college student. And this is actually my last year of school, y'all. So <clears throat> I figured why not vlog my last year, my last first day of school. This is my last year of college. This is at least my last year of undergrad. I might do grad school, but that's looking like a big hell no right now, so. For now, this is my first last day of school vlog. So, I mean, I think this is the perfect time for me to make these vlogs and put them out for y'all. Maybe for y'all freshmen that might be going here or people who might be wanting to go to Georgia Southern. It's a great school. So, yeah, y'all keep watching and I'm gonna take y'all with me on my little journey. Let me show y'all my little dorm. So I actually stay in an apartment. It's like a student, student living, but it's other people who live here that's not in school. And this is not for freshmen. Freshmen have to stay on campus, so. This is like my little, um, oh, inches. Okay, y'all already see my little mirror. I made this mirror. I made this mirror sophomore year, I think, but let me show y'all my bathroom. So, sorry, y'all, the soap looks so ghetto. And really, I need to clean up in here. It looks kind of ghetto, like that's out of place. But this is my little bathroom, y'all. I got this thing from Bath and Body Works. This little piece right here is $14, and you can buy these for like $6 really like 350 if they're on sale and they have so many different scents and it makes it smell so good and i got my little lights up and my theme when i first moved in was like pink and white so it's like pink towels white towels got a little pink candle a little white thing right there i got all my skincare in here all my soap and stuff stuff to brush my teeth with and all that um i got a cute little things right here it's little pink and white things and then this little thing, I just think it's so cute. It doesn't, I don't think it works, but water is supposed to come out and it's supposed to be like a little light. It's so cute. I might turn it on. And then this also lights up like an S for my name. Some more stuff over there that I kind of wanted to hide. I don't want you to see that when you walk in. And then my shower curtain, I need to change it honestly. And then this, it lights up like reddish pink. Then I got pink towels, a little marble thing. I had a, a marble towel to match that, but I bleached it and it turned brown. But yeah, that's my little bathroom. I got all my little scrubs right there, my tree hut, you know what I'm saying? Pink and white loofahs. It's really cute. I love my bathroom. And my room is messy right now, y'all. I shouldn't be showing y'all. Honestly, I'm probably gonna cut this and show y'all when my room is clean. Yeah, I'm very excited for my last year of school. It's bittersweet, but it's more sweet than it is bitter because um, I've actually already been here four years. So this is like my fifth year. Um, just to finish up some things, you know, I had some bumps in the road. It'd be like that sometimes, you know, that's completely normal. So don't feel discouraged if that's happening to you. Cause I definitely don't feel discouraged. I just feel thankful that I'm even in this position and blessed that I'm about to graduate, you know? So yeah, I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Ooh, I look a hot mess right now, but hey y'all, good morning. Um, I'm about to get ready to go to class. Right now, it's like, what time is it? It's like 11 o'clock. It's like, okay, it's literally 10.59 a.m. And I don't have class today until 2.30. So I have plenty of time to get ready, but I wanna have time to like eat something and then fix my hair and everything and vlog for y'all. So I got up kind of early. Um, so yeah, I'm just about to take a shower and everything and do a face mask, do a little bit of light makeup. And then I'm gonna go down to my leasing office and pick up my package because the leggings I wanna wear today are at the leasing office. So I'm gonna go pick those up. And yeah, I'm just gonna take y'all with me on my little back to school last first day. I see we're gonna have some fun. Okay, period. I have to walk down to this leasing office to get my package. Um, and I got me a fresh bottle of water, cold bottle of water in the morning. This is what I always try to start with because first of all, you need to drink a lot of water every day. So it's good to start in the morning so you can hydrate all day. And then people say like, it's good to start with water, like cold water, because it gets your, um, it gets your like system going, I guess, like it helps your metabolism and everything. So 
I'm about to drink this and walk down to get my package. Yeah, it's 11.51, so I'm about to um wash my face and everything, do a little quick face mask. I didn't do my face mask last night, so I'm going to do this face mask. This is from Salt XO. Can y'all see that? Salt XO is the Hydra Mask Brightening Mask used for face and the JJ. So I'm going to put that all on my face and everything. Um, I'm going to fix my lace, lay my edges, you know, get my hair a little bit more sleek and straight. Um, I don't even know if I'm wearing this outfit yet. Y'all can't even see it, but I'll show y'all my outfit when I'm done getting dressed. My sister got me this little thing that protects my hair, like when I'm washing my face, so you know my lace won't lift and my edges won't mess up. And this is like the greatest thing ever. Like, y'all see how that works? And it just moves my hair out the way. Like, just pull it over my edges, and boom boom out that's how you fix that so my mama got me this little thing right here by fabu day and it has all these little things that i can switch it out for there's seven of them and there's like an exfoliating one they have all different kinds y'all but i'm just gonna use the regular daily cleansing one and i'm also using my facial wash by salt xo the citrus detox for acne and dark spots so gonna use these two to wash my face <coughs> child i'm obviously going through it this morning I don't know how that water got in my mouth. So yeah, face is clean, fresh. That's how we like it. We trying to start off this school year, the first and last day with glow. So we gonna put this hydro mask on. Not too thick, but not too thin, you know what I'm saying? Put a um, gracious amount. So while we wait for this to dry, do my hair in the meantime and let's chit chat about Georgia Southern and everything, my experience thus far at Georgia Southern University. Oh, so, yeah, I'm about to flat iron my hair on 400 on super hot because I need this wig to last. And the details on this hair, y'all, if y'all like this hair in this frontal, I have two videos up. This is Arbella hair. Um, I have a review. And then I have an actual install of me um, customizing the wig and all that. So y'all go watch those. So I'm a senior at Georgia Southern and this is actually my fifth year being here. And I mean, thus far I've had a good experience with Georgia Southern. Um, I'm not mad that I picked this school. I've met a lot of good people and this is a big school, but it has a very small feel. Like I think there's over like 20, 21,000 students. There might even be more this year because I heard we had a big freshman class, but Georgia Southern is a good school. Um, the campus is very big, so. But yeah, like I was saying, um, I like this school. These are PWI, so it's predominantly white and there is a lot of white people, but at the same time, to me, it's kind of like, it feels like half and half. And I don't think that's quite the ratio. I think it's more like 40, 60, but there's a lot of black people here. And I mean, me, I hang out with the black crowd. So you just gotta get down here and you know find your crowd and that's not hard to do because like I said I mean even though this is a PWI there's also a lot of black folks I don't know why Georgia State assumes that they are the issue, but they're not because first of all we've been here first and 
They got their little campus downtown and now they want to claim they the real Jiu-Jitsu, but no, baby. We've been here. Campus is beautiful. It's a very big school. Um, there's a lot of people down here, so you got chances to network and meet a lot of different people. Um, if you're from the Atlanta area like me, it's a chance to kind of like get away from home, but you're not really that far from home because it's really only three hours away. And on top of that, there's a lot of people from the metro Atlanta area in Atlanta in general who go to this school. So you're going to be far from home, but it doesn't feel like it because it's people literally from your county that go here. You got to think about it. It's 21,000 students plus probably more than that this year. Like I mentioned, like there's so many people. So <clears throat> it's just chances to meet new people. And if you're already from Atlanta area and you want something different, you know, for college, I definitely recommend this school. I, I mean, that's really why I chose this. I wanted something different and I didn't want to have to be going to school like right down the street from my mama because that kind of defeats the purpose of like, you know, going off of college. If I wanted to do a situation where <clears throat> I was closer to home and I was still in school, then I would have went to something like state or Kennesaw State. But if you want to like experience living on your own, uh oh, I got some mask in my hair, y'all. Yeah, if you want to experience living on your own and like, you know, just kind of being away from home and I guess you could say travel a little. It's only three hours away from home, but it is kind of like, you know, venturing off a little bit, almost like moving out of state because it's a three hour drive every time. Only thing I would say is I wish it was like down here. Um, when you go to an HBCU, obviously it's predominantly a black institution with black students and black professors, but here, we have a lot of black students and there's not really black professors to match that ratio. And I understand it because it's a predominantly white institution. So I'm pretty sure it was a point in time where there re wasn't really a lot of black students here. And I guess now that that's different for Southern, um, the, the, the black student to black teacher ratio isn't really equivalent because that amount five years, my four years of being here and this is my fifth year, I don't even know if I have black professors this year. But um, out of all my four years, I've maybe had one. I might have literally only had like one or two black professors. And then the class that I had a black professor was African American theater. But I mean, nonetheless, all the white professors are cool. You got your situations every now and then where something racist might happen in class. Cause I mean, it is a lot of white people in this country down here. But that's not really all the time, you know. That has happened a couple of times, but I mean, you go to a school with white folks with black people, you gotta expect that. So that's really where any PWI you're gonna be at. But like I said, that's not that often. And that's all, that's everyday life in general when you're dealing with people of the opposite spectrum. So it's not a reason for you not to come to this school. Cause at the end of the day, you're here to get your education and you're here to meet people, network, and live the college experience. And I definitely think that this school is great for that. <laughs> I'm trying to straighten my hair and I got this mask on at the same time and I keep getting yellow stuff in my hair. Like, that's ghetto. Oh, and what I forgot to mention y'all, Georgia Southern is a party school, okay? When they said that, they was not lying. And apparently, before I got down here, it was even more of a party school because they had more bars open and everything. And I guess people was partying more because they saying a lot of the stuff that was down here prior to me coming down here, I started in um, 2017. Oh my God, that seems so long ago. <laughs> I started in 2017 and they saying before I got down here, it was really a lot of bars open and people used to party a lot more. And it's still a lot of partying if you ask me. Cause there's plenty of bars down here and shoot people down here party every day but on the weekends it definitely do be jumping though okay y'all let me get through my hair i'm just gonna do this real fast and then i'll come back to the camera and talk to y'all some more and um wash off this mask and all that so my got this hair mixed up yeah i'm about to be done with school and that in itself excites me it makes me like very excited and proud of myself but it's like i'm about to be done with school like i spent so much time down here and i met so many different people like in college you really make some bonds and like you really meet great people you meet a lot of goal-oriented people and you just meet people that's on your level and on your vibe and 
I mean, you really, you really need family in college. Like, you down at school and you with these people every day. Like, you living with people that you that you met, and y'all end up having the best bonds ever. Like, y'all, college is lit. I'm about to do just a little bit of makeup because I really like the natural look. I'm just going to do a little bit of makeup and then um, put on some lashes and then I'll be good to go and I'm done, y'all. And I just like, I put a little bit of highlighter. Like I mix it with my foundation so that I can like kind of have a little bit of a glow. So I'm just gonna take a little bit. Oh, y'all see the little little flurries flying? It's so pretty. And just just barely. I don't want to do a lot today, y'all. We going for a very subtle, subtle glow. Like we want to glow. We want to look real natural and good. Like if somebody see you from across campus and they see you glowing and you looking real good and smooth and mind your business with your hair laid. That's what we give them. Y'all like my skin to look real, really, really like glowy and dewy. So I'm gonna go in with this again. This just like kind of helps set my face in and it gives me like a set like dewy look. Like it looks so good, y'all. I love this stuff and I keep this. So I'm gonna spray this. It's every video. This is the lash glue that I use. Um, I am me super stronghold clear because you don't want it to be looking messy with black dots because that's how y'all be walking around looking i know because i used to be the same way but please help yourself and get this So these are the lashes that I used. Can y'all see? I envy in the um is vivid 3D and this is number 65. Can y'all see that? And this is what it looks like. And I put two pairs. So I use one pair, then I stacked another pair on top because I like my lashes to be like real thick and voluminous. So so y'all, this is my outfit. Um, it's very very casual. I'm just going to class. So I got my little Adidas gray stripe leggings some um glitter birkenstocks then just a white tank top the shirt i wanted to wear i can't find it so this is what i'm wearing then i'm taking my purse with me i don't have any bookshare or anything i haven't been to the store and then i'm gonna take my little laptop bag with me and yeah this is the look so yeah i'm about to go get on the bus right now and then i'll see y'all when i get to campus i guess this is how my hair and makeup looks when I'm next to the window. I like it. I really do. It gives a very natural glow. Yeah. I don't really have time to eat anything, but it's okay because I'll probably eat on campus or just eat when I get back home. I'm not really that hungry anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna walk to the shuttle now.
So I got some Chick-fil-A uh, class in like 15 minutes. So I'm gonna hurry up and eat and everything. So yeah. So I went to Chick-fil-A, went to class. Now I'm out of that class. It was supposed to end at 3.45, but it ended like 15 minutes early. I have another class at four in the same classroom because y'all, my major, literally all my classes are in the same building and this class is in the same room. And um, yeah, now I'm just waiting for that class to start. And I just came outside because I don't want to sit in the classroom and wait because I've already been sitting in there for over an hour and I'm going to sit in there for another an hour 15 minutes or whatever 50 minutes or whatever so I'm just walking around finishing my drink and it's really chill he just went over this little bit y'all for my first class and that was it we introduced ourselves and let me tell y'all some it's hot as hell like I can't even think straight it's so hot out here but anyways let me go back over here to my table where my stuff's sitting at for somebody still my MacBook and I gotta whoop somebody ass. This is my building that I'm in every day. This is Sanford Hall. If you're majoring in film production like me or anything in that area, then you'll probably be in here for all your classes. Well, at least when you're like a junior, senior, yeah. It's right next to the museum. stadium right there another building right there I believe that this is cone hall the class that I just got out of said that I need to have my book really today because the next time we come to class I have to have read the first two chapters for what we're going to talk about so yeah I'm probably going to go I'll probably go tomorrow to the bookstore and get all my books um, I don't have any Friday classes, so I'm probably not going to come on Friday. I'll go on Thursday to get my books, so. I just left my second class so I'm done for the day and that class was very interesting I think I'm gonna enjoy that class so um yeah oh something just fell on me I'll definitely record tomorrow's day as well um right now I'm gonna meet up with my friend Haley and we're gonna go to Walmart because y'all I gotta buy some groceries so I can stop spending money out I done had DoorDash like three times since I've been here and I've only been here like three days so that's like literally every day good morning y'all it is thursday august 12th and i'm about to get ready to, well i'm getting ready to go to class i have to be to class at 9 30 or right now it's like 8 45 so i gotta go catch the shuttle at 9 so i can go to camp and y'all look at my skin right now it's giving like no i don't need to wear no makeup like y'all see this glow i got right now I just use my moisturizer. I use um, a belief belief moisturizer. I'll insert a pic. And then Urban Skin Rx, their sunscreen. I just put that on my face. And y'all, my face looks so good. Like, who need makeup? Because it's giving glow. It's giving them dark spots trying to go away. It's giving, don't play on my skin, period. So right now, I'm just going to put on some lashes. And that's all. That's all I'm gonna leave it at today is lashes and lip gloss because you know the makeup was cute yesterday. You know, it gave a little cute glow, a little extra glow, but obviously I don't need no extra glow. Look at me. I already look good. So let me put these lashes on. You know, sometimes it's just me. I don't even be wanting to wear lashes when my face looks like this. Like 
a lot of people want to wear is a little bit of lip gloss and i just feel like i look so fine like So today I have three classes and one thing about me, <clears throat> in college there are going to be early classes. Um, as far as I know, as early as 8 a.m., which really means that you need to be up no later than like 7 a.m. And let me tell y'all something. I don't know why I be up till like 2, 3 in the morning. So I can't do 8 a.m. classes because I'm four hours of sleep. I literally would be falling asleep in class and just so tired like i need my full seven eight hours of sleep really nine because i'm just like a, a big baby and this 9 30 i feel like it's gonna be my struggle all semester having to get up at like 8 a.m and then having to catch the shuttle 30 minutes before class like this getting up at 8 a.m is gonna kill me and really this morning i got up at 7 45 because i knew i needed like 15 minutes to get out of bed and I really went over that time. I didn't get out the bed until like 8, 10, y'all. And I didn't even have to straighten my hair this morning. For the most part, my hair stays straight. So all I'm doing is putting on lashes and lip gloss today. And my sunscreen. Don't forget your sunscreen. I look so crazy right now, but one lash on and one not on. Honestly, I could have went no lashes, y'all. I look so cute. Done. I don't have no time to waste y'all I gotta go get on this shuttle so and then I'm literally gonna go get on this shuttle right now because I'm not trying to be late oh I'm gonna fix my edges a little bit and lay that lace right there child that's the thing about frontals you be having to fix them every morning but yeah I just got out of my first class and now um, we got out of class early so I'm gonna go to Starbucks and give me a latte because first of all I'm about to fall asleep and I still got two more classes and I don't want to fall asleep in class so I'm gonna go ahead and buy me a coffee I'm probably gonna end up taking a nap when I get home but I'm gonna try to stay up because if I take a nap then I'll be up all night and then it'll just be a continuous cycle of me not wanting to wake up early and everything. So I'm buying coffee for my sleep schedule and to keep me awake all day. So yeah. Some stuff going on over here at the Rotunda. This is called the Rotunda, this little circle thing. And they always got tables over here. And they got some stuff, some organizations, sororities, fraternities out here. Okay, I got my Starbucks and I got class in like nine minutes. I'm trying to hurry up and get across campus because Starbucks is not close. I mean, it's close to Sanford, but if you're trying to get to class in like 15 minutes, then child, you better be speed walking. And best believe I'm speed walking right now. I got a, ooh, I'm out of breath. I got a cinnamon dulce latte with heavy cream and a hazelnut shot. I just love hazelnut anything. Like hazelnut just tastes, why I look so black? Hazelnut just tastes so good to me. And I got whipped cream. And then I got an almond croissant. Let me show y'all. Starbucks is so good. Like, I see what my girls be drinking all the time. For real. I already drank some of this, y'all can see. I wish it was a little sweeter, but I mean, I just really need the coffee to keep me up. Then my almond croissant, I got it warmed up. 
So you say warm food. They almond croissants be so good, y'all. So I'm done with two out of three of my classes for today. I still haven't eaten this because I didn't have time to eat in class. But yeah, my next class starts at two. Right now I'm just walking, trying to kill some time. But it's been a good day so far. I'm just gonna go sit somewhere and wait for my next class. And I just ordered all my books for my classes. So that's basically my first day, y'all. Y'all, look at my outfit. Like, I'm so cute. My little purse. Then my little biker shorts and my little black crop top. And my little necklace for Nicole, Simone Nicole. And then my little phone case. Like, y'all, I look so cute. And then my mask is black, too. Like, and look at my nails. I'm a real icy girl, period. She was iced out. Like, I'm just a cute college student. I love that for me. First of all, I'm tired. Look at my hair. I'm very sleepy. I probably got like what? I went to bed at like two something. Got up at eight, like five, six hours of sleep. Yeah. And I would sit inside, but I hate being cold. And the building that all my classes are in is so cold. So I'd rather just sit outside in the shade because it just feels better to me. And I like being outside. I love being outside. So, I'm gonna sit right here on this bench and eat my croissant. Ooh, my deodorant. Eat my croissant and wait for my two o'clock class to start. Y'all, this shit's so good. Mm. yeah and i just want to say like campus right now is literally so packed and that's because it's the first week so everybody's showing up to class like everybody shows up in the first week but after that campus gets like thinner and it's not as many people but like it y'all seen the clip earlier where campus was so packed when i first when i was walking to my first class like it's so packed and full right now but i just know in like a week in like two weeks that it's not gonna be this packed anymore but here? I, I guarantee you. I guarantee you. How many professors are going to stand up? No way. That's a college student. In a Tesla. I'm back home. I'm about to walk into my apartment. I got this package from Shein. Do y'all see how big this is? And I'm actually about to do a haul on these items that I got as well. So, yeah, y'all. Thank y'all for coming with me. This vlog was kind of um, boring if you ask me, but that's the first week for you. 
so i told y'all earlier that i bought that coffee to help me stay up in glass and so that i don't take a nap when i get home and i just have a bad habit of like when i lay down i can't help it like i be ready to go to sleep so i'm literally fighting sleep right now but i'm gonna get up and um make myself some burger tacos I made the birria tacos yesterday. I didn't get it on camera, but um, I made the meat for the tacos yesterday. So all I gotta do is just um, go make the actual taco and I'm gonna eat. But like, that's gonna be even worse. Cause once I eat, I'm really gonna be like drowsy. Cause I know once y'all eat a big meal, y'all be tired, right? Cause like right now I'm already sleepy and I need to get up, but like, what is there to do? Mm, I don't know. So it's looking like I'm gonna fall asleep, but I'm gonna try not to. But yeah, y'all, this was just a vlog. Um, I never did a college vlog, so I just wanted to at least like, you know, record one and see what it would be like for you guys. Um, Next, like in the future, I'm gonna bring y'all some vlogs that are a little bit more entertaining. I know that this vlog really wasn't that entertaining, or maybe it was to you, but I just feel like this wasn't really one of my more entertaining type of vlogs and I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just sleepy. Like, I've been sleepy all day. When I got to get up early, child, I be walking around like, I just be sleepy because I'm like a baby. I need, I be needing to sleep for like 12 hours. <laughs> Not literally, but I just be like sleepy if I got to get up early. So I've been really sleepy today. And y'all can see I'm laying down in this bed, trying not to fall asleep, but I know myself. I'm probably going to be sleeping like the next hour. So, um, Thank y'all so much for watching this vlog. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this and hope that you guys subscribe to my channel to see more college vlogs. Um, hope you guys like the video and comment any thoughts or questions that y'all have because I'm here to answer them. And yeah, so thank y'all for watching. Bye.